What's going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today I want to help you guys out who are struggling with this week's Nightfall. I mean let's face it, it isn't the easiest we've had so far and yeah for sure while some at a high level this may have been a walk in the park for. Please don't forget that not everybody plays this game 24-7 and do indeed still need help in places like these. But before we go any further guys, I am giving away weekly server prizes for Xbox and Playstation. To win some, simply drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. Okay, so this week's Nightfall being Exodus Crash, it isn't the easiest. It's timed obviously with time warp, strange anomalies have been detected in the area, destroy them to release temporal energy and extend the mission timer, and we have attrition. Health and shield regeneration is significantly impaired, defeating enemies may create wells of light, collect those to restore your health and charge your super. So yeah it isn't the easiest and the nightfall being exodus crash where the last boss is tanky and disappears for up to minutes at a time this one can be a little difficult so first things first i will show you guys this little cheese to help you gain that also important extra time now we ain't going to type my video unlimited time glitch or anything like that because simply that's bs there are a max number of anomalies you can collect through this strike and once you've collected enough the others you collect will not count so it isn't an infinite time glitch whatsoever. It is however a kind of cheese for extra time. So this is what you do. Through the first few areas pick up as many anomalies as possible. Doesn't matter if you collect them all or not. Just get through this area as fast as possible. You will then come to the point where we're at in this video right here. Where you have to analyse this fallen device and basically defend this point until 100% and take out the two servitors. This in itself can take away a few minutes off your timer for sure. Once done here though, you carry on into the Exodus Black area. Here, all three of your teammates can do this time trees, or two of you can move on and one person stays behind to do this. What you do is, from this point, you simply head back in the direction you came from, and as I do on screen now, you simply shoot this anomaly over this kind of barrier to gain that extra 30 seconds. Jump on your sparrow, go back to the excess black area, turn back on yourself, do this again. Simply rinse and repeat until you hit that maximum time limit. You'll see it says maximum time limit reached on your screen when you've done this. Now the maximum time limit can vary depending on how many anomalies you've picked up already and how fast you've got to this point but roughly 10 minutes from this point should be okay. So from here you need to get to that last boss room as soon as possible so quickly take out that spider tank and move on. Don't bother looking for any more anomalies as they will not count towards your timer so it'd be wasted time. When you do arrive in that final boss room I really suggest you use the risk runner SMG. This thing does serious work and because the floor is electric most of the time, you never have to reload. Three of us using these did serious damage to the boss for sure. Paired with supers, power weapons and so on, you should make easy work of it. Don't worry though if you die as it doesn't reset, you just have to wait so you can revive yourself. I died a few times here just putting as much damage into the boss as I could before he disappears because like I said, when he does, he can disappear for up to a minute. So I'll damage him while you can. And guys, it shouldn't be that bad for you. Using that cheese for extra time and the risk runner, it should be a piece of cake, people. And on that note, guys, I hope this video helped you out. Thanks for stopping by as always. Subscribe if you're new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos. And hopefully, people, I will see you on that next one. Get it right.